What is the degree of recurrence relation? Solve the recurrence relation a n is equal to 5 a n minus 1 minus 6 a n minus 2 for n value is greater than or equal to 2 with initial condition a not equal to 1 a 1 is equal to 0. Now first let me write degree. Since there is a n minus 2 so the, the degree will be 2. Now take all the terms on the left hand side a n minus 5 a n minus 1 plus 6 a n minus 2 is equal to 0. Now you have to find characteristic equation. So since the degree is 2, so I'll write here r square minus 5r plus 6 is equal to 0. You can find the roots by calculator or by factorization method. I'll go with the factorization method. Minus 2 minus 3. 2 3 is a 6 minus into minus is plus minus 2 minus 3 is minus 5. Now r1 will become if it is minus then write plus. If it is minus then write plus. So the two roots are uh, r1 is equal to 2 r2 is equal to 3. So roots are distinct. Okay. So when the roots are distinct means different. So you need to apply theorem 1. And for that the formula is a n is equal to alpha 1 r 1 raised to n plus alpha 2 r 2 raised to n. Substitute r 1 r 2 value in this. A n alpha 1 2 raised to n plus alpha 2 3 raised to n. Okay. Now initial condition is a naught means n value is 0. So alpha 1 2 raised to 0 plus alpha 2 3 raised to 0. Always remember anything raised to 0 is 1. Now what is the value of a naught? It is 1. So 1 is equal to alpha 1 plus alpha 2 because this is 1 and this is also 1. Next a naught is 0 uh, a 1 sorry a 1. So n value is 1 here now. So alpha 1 2 raised to 1 plus alpha 2 3 raised to 1. What is the value of this? 0. Now this will become 2 alpha 1 plus 3 alpha 2. Fine. Now solving this by again calculator you will get alpha 1 and alpha 2 value. Now finding in calculator. So go to mode in that equation in that unknown select 2 because there are two unknowns that is alpha 1 and alpha 2. Now remember when you are solving with the calculator the coefficient of alpha 1 is 1. The coefficient of alpha 2 is 1 and then write 1. Coefficient of alpha 1 is 2. Coefficient of alpha 2 is 3 then 0. Then you will get alpha 1 as a minus 2, alpha 2 as a 3 in calculator. Okay. Once you get this substitute in the main formula. I will write once again the formula. This is the main formula. A n alpha 1 is minus 2. R1 is 2 raised to n and uh, alpha 2 is 3. R2 is 3 raised to n. So this completes your final answer.